Hi people, uh, today we are, I'm going to be reading a Yushi Ten fanfiction. Uh, Yushiji, the pairing is Yushijima x Tendo Satori. Okay, so, so if you, if you just didn't, didn't know that, it's a one shot and it's called Migraine. I'm going to put the link of the creator in the description if of the video if you want to read it i would suggest go supporting the creator because it's really really good and they do really other really good works okay i'm gonna get on to the reading tento looked at the clock on the wall 150 fuck satori said as he put his head down on his desk an hour and 30 minutes left at this point, I'm probably gonna sur not going to survive the volleyball practice, but I still should go. The bell rang, and it was time to leave his to go to his last class. He lazily, he lazily picked up all of his stuff, shoving it away to his backpack, swinging it, swinging it onto one, onto his shoulder. His last class of the day was study hall. Thankfully, once he arrived. Once he arrived, he headed toward the back of the cafeteria, deciding that he'd maybe try to do some homework. He, wa he walked towards the back of the cafeteria, trying, taking out a small amount of homework and staring at it in front of him, trying to focus on it, but to no avail. His head pounded more and more and as he stared at it. After five minutes, he just sighed, gathering up all of his stuff and putting it into his backpack before resting his head onto the cool surface of the table. Time went by agonizingly slow for the middle blocker as he felt sick, sickly curling up, up a bit. After 45 hellish minutes, the bell finally rang once, not once, but multiple times in his mind. He lifted his head up from his, his arms, the brightness blinding him, making it even worse. He stumbled in out of his chair before get, getting his backpack and heading into the gym. Usually he was one of the first ones to arrive, but with how sluggish he was walking in, feeling he was one of the last ones there. It was some, that was something that Yushi, Yushijima noticed as Tendo walked into, walked in not looking his normal self. It took Tendo longer than usual to get changed for practice, something Yushijima noticed as well as Tendo walked out. Hey, Tendo, are you feeling okay? The ace asked the, asked the middle blocker, but got, got no answer as the middle blocker just stared blankly at him with a pain in his eyes. Come here, Wakatoshi said, holding his arms out slightly as T Tendo walked over to him, slowly pla placing his forehead on the ace, ace's forehead. Starting, starting to relax a bit. Are you okay, Tendo? He yeah, asked slightly, slightly, sh the slightly shorter male rubbing his back, not caring the at all if it, his teammates were staring at them because they were literally in the middle of the gym. Tendo hesitantly nodded and b before shaking his head softly. Okay, go go and change and stay in the locker room. I'll come. I'll get you when practice is over, Yushima said before before leading him to the doors of the locker room before heading back to the uh, to the rest of the team as if nothing had happened. Tendo sat down on the bench, curling up next to the lockers, done with his bo body torturing him in this way. He grabbed him to the side of his head, pulling his hair hair a bit, curling up a bit more. Make it stop, please. He whispered softly to no one in particular. In particular, small tears making their way down down his face, as he held on to himself. Time skip. Hey, coach, can can I go go check on Tendo? Uchijima stated halfway walking through their pra practice, not even asking as he walked by. Uchijima walked in into the locker room first. At, all the lights were turned off. He figured Tendo didn't want them on, so he left them off. He walked over to Tendo. Tendo's. He walked over towards Tendo's locker to see him curled up with dried tears on his face. 
He changed quickly before nudging him a bit, telling him to get up. Maybe you should try to take a shower, that might help. Ishijima told the metal blocker who nodded, standing up and staring, starting to undress as Ushibaka left, left a small blush on his face. Satori so then fin finished some clothing, walking over to the showers. He turned the water on, letting it rain down on him. It dulled the pain in his head, but didn't help that much with his mind. He sat down, letting the water tri trickle down, down and hit him as he dr drowned in his mind. Yet another time skip. You're welcome. Yushijima walked into the locker rooms to see a story with a towel on his head on on his waist and another one drying his hair. Can you tell me when when you were decent, Yushijima uh, asked, turn, turning away from Satori, blushing slightly. I mean, we could change in front of each other, or... I mean, we change in front of each other all the time, but okay. Satori laughed slightly at me before informing Yushiwaka that he could turn around. I am gonna ta take you to your house, okay? He assessed the middle blocker. Softly, as his eyes k kind of wished that that he shook his head quickly, regretting that wincing, win that wincing at the pain pl pulsing through his head and mind. No, okay. Do you want me to take you to my house instead? He asked him. Tendo nodded slightly, standing up and slowly as his head pa pounded louder and louder. They both walked out of the locker room, close together, walking through the gym towards Ushijima's car. I forgot my bag. I'll be right. I'll be right back. You can start the car if you want to. Ushijima informed Tendo, ha handing him the keys to the car. As Tendo nodded again slightly, a bit, a bit heading towards the passenger side of the car, the team looked at Ushijima strangely as he walked back in towards the locker room. Is Tendo okay? Koshiki asked, fiddling with his hands a bit, tilting his head to the side. I don't think so. I'm taking him to my house. Ishijima replied nonchalantly, fixing his volleyball bag onto his shoulder. Why your house? Sunny asked, putting his hand on his hip like a supermodel. He didn't seem to want to go to his home. He, he responded to Sunny, deadpanning, deadpanned as usual. Is his home life okay? Leon asked, concerned laced in his voice. I don't know, but Tendo is waiting for me. I'm sorry for disturbing practice. Ishijima bowed as they all at, at them all before leaving it and heading back to the car. Then, when he got back to the car, he saw the middle blocker leaning onto the window, his eyes shut in discomfort. The car wasn't started yet, but the keys were in the ignition. Ishijima started the car, startling Tendo a bit. Hey, it's okay, Ushiwaka said softly, trying to comfort the middle blocker. Tendo seemed to calm down a bit as his words, at his words, slamming his head back on the window. Could you make the AC cold? Tendo asked quietly, his voice giving him, him on him a bit. Uh, of course, Ushiwaka answered, changing the AC for Tendo. In no, in no time at all, they had arrived at Ushijima's house. He nudged Tendo a bit, a bit the middle blocker jumping at his touch. It's just me. We're here. He told, he told Satori, trying to calm him down. Very small time skip. After changing into more comfortable clothes, Uchiji, Ushijima led Tendo down to the kitchen. Do you want something for dinner? Ushijima asked, Tendo looking at him with a small with small concern showing in his eyes. A bagel, Tendo answered. Tendo answered his head holding his hand holding his head. Just one bagel? Ushijima asked, raising his eyes. Two bagels, Tendo sighed, trying to please Ushiwaka a bit. What, with or without cream cheese, Ushiwaka asked him, get, getting the bagels out, out of the fridge. With cream cheese, Tendo responded, placing his head on the cold counter. Ushijima placed the bagels in front of Tendo, sitting down next to him with a bowl of cereal. 
They both sat next to each other in a comfortable, in comfortable silence, eating their food. They finished their food. They finished their food, Ishijima taking the dishes and putting them away. Satori headed up to the, up the stairs to Ishijima's room, slowly laying down, not to agitate his head. Ishijima then walked into into the room, laying down next to Satori. The lights already off. It was only seven, but Tendo looked like he wanted to sleep. But Wakatoshi wanted to talk to him a bit. Tendo, can we talk? I'm a bit worried for you. Ishijima soft, softly asked as Satori turned around to fa face him and looked slant of a look of silent fear fell on his face. What about? Why do you, do you not want to go home? Ishijima has not not sure coding it at all at all of that that was something he didn't know how to do. Sidori kind of flinched at the sudden question. I just don't like being there, Sidori answered vaguely, just trying to shrug it off. I don't believe that's that is all of it. Uh Yushima said staring at Tendo. Wakatoshi, I don't really want to talk about it. Sidori said to your Tears falling in his eyes as he yawned for some as he yearned for someone to hold. Okay, but are you okay right now? Shima asked the metal blocker, moving his hair out of his face. Not really. Satori responded, looking away from him. I'm going to try something that I've seen people do to comfort people they love. Yushima warned him before pulling the metal blocker towards him, holding him tight. At first, Tendo was a bit tense, but he soon re relaxed into Yushijima's arms, feeling his emotions flow out. It's okay, I've got you, Satori, Yushijima whispered, kissing Satori's forehead, softly as Satori cried. Thank you, Wakatoshi. Satori whispered back, snuggling into Wakatoshi's chest and falling asleep. Thank you too, Satori, Yushijima whispered. What? One last time, realizing that Satori was asleep, he fell, he fell asleep to her, uh, and just laid there, holding each, uh, holding each other. Extra, Yushima's mother opened the door, her husband next to her. She squealed a bit at the cute scene in front of her. <laughs> Told you, she whispered. She whispered, yelled at her husband, son. Side handling, side handing her twenty dollars before she took a picture of the two. Okay, that was it. Um, as I said, it's really good. You should really check out the uh, author. Um, I was thinking, would you guys, would any of you, um, like to see my own work? Cause I also write fan fiction. I'm starting to do a, uh, uh, Gundam Tanaka X male reader, well, X depressed male reader. Um, I, I could do that one. I'm also, ones that I'm also currently writing, I have a Sutsuyama fanfiction where Yamaguchi is depressed. I have a, um, other ones. Uh, I'm also writing a Kyoyachi fanfiction where ya where uh, Yachi is depressed, which um, I actually really enjoy that, like writing that and stuff. I do like other crack more like fun bits too. I also do like chat bits on there. But that's pretty much of the still continuing stuff. I've done a few one shots. If you guys would like me to read my one shots. I did a Momojiro one shot, a Love Yaku one shot, and a Shinjiro one shot. Um, if any of you would like to um, read or listen or listen to me read them, you could say that in the comments. I will, as again, list 
I'll link my Instagram, Wattpad, and my TikTok, and the, and the, um, story, if you ever want to read that, um, okay, I hope you guys all had a great day, or if you didn't, I hope that, um, you have a great sleep, if you're planning on sleeping, um, or you have a great day, I wish to give you virtual hugs and love, uh, remember to drink or eat something, anything, it doesn't have to be, it doesn't have to be a full meal, it could just be a snack, just anything, and please stay hydrated and stay safe, again, if you ever need to talk to me, uh, you can d DM me on any of my social media platforms, have a great day or night, you're all, you're all lovely people.